Environment Canada says the month of June was very wet and quite a bit cooler than last year. After record-setting temperatures hammered most of BC in 2021, Kelowna saw a big drop in heat and a spike in precipitation. What we've seen this year is that um, that persistence of uh, a cold, wet pattern um, for Kelowna and Vernon, both those communities saw 140% of their normal precipitation, so just uh, more widespread rain over that region in particular. The general weather trends across the southern interior were colder than normal temperatures. Environment Canada says the temperature anomaly was anywhere from about a 0.5 degrees to 1 degree colder than normal. But compared to last year's heat dome, it's a massive drop. We saw record-breaking temperatures, not just for the province, but for all of Canada for multiple days in a row. And um, with those conditions in place, uh, communities all across BC saw their hottest June on record, which includes uh, Penticton, Kelowna, Vernon, and Kamloops all coming in um, anywhere from about uh, three to five degrees above normal for the month of June in 2021. Looking at the numbers, Kelowna saw roughly 65 milliliters of rain this month and only 13.5 in the month of June last year, a difference of 51.5 milliliters. May and June are typically some of the wettest months for the Okanagan and Kamloops, and that's because the weather pattern is so often dominated by either what we call upper low systems that bring widespread precipitation or uh, just sort of day-to-day uh, convection. So that would be your sort of afternoon and evening showers and thunderstorms. As the Canada Day long weekend wraps up, temperatures in the low 30s are expected to drop to the mid-20s by the middle of the week. I'm Bray Nursel in Kelowna for Castanet.